the 2018 World Cup is upon us, and of course, since there is no Team USA, I'm not really sure who we're supposed to root for as members of the American race, but regardless, it's an annual tradition here, and I know I've been away from doing videos for a while, and this is my big comeback, so to speak. We're doing it low-key. We'll have a more in-depth video explaining my apps a little bit more in, in the future, but for now, let's get down to business. Let's take a look at the World Cup. Let's make my annual, well not annual, my quad-annual I suppose, predictions. Let's get right down to it. We got this snazzy website from the Russians, made by the Chinese apparently. Should be fun. So let's roll with it. All right. Let's see what we got here. All right. So group A over here. I'm going to rank them real quick. I think uh, Uruguay should pretty much run away with that one. That's not a surprise. We'll go with the home country, Russia, is second, uh, between Egypt and Saudi Arabia. Uh, kind of a mix and match there, but I got them ranked like that. Uh, then we go over here to Group B. Well, I obviously think Spain is pretty much uh, the favorite there. Portugal second. Uh, I'm going to go with Marseille and Iran dead last. I kind of see a recurring theme there with uh, the Middle Eastern countries not doing all that well. Over in Group C, I'm going to go with France to win it. No, actually, hold on. I'm going to go with Peru. Let's switch them up. I'm going to go with Peru to win it. France come in second. Denmark third. Australia fourth. So there's that. Over in Group D, going Argentina, Croatia, Nigeria, and Iceland. Just don't see them doing too much there. Over here in Group E, I'm going to go with Brazil. Uh, is that Costa Rica or Croatia? I believe that. Okay, it's Costa Rica. So yeah, I want to go with Costa Rica, uh, Switzerland, Serbia. Group F, pretty much an obvious foregone conclusion there. I'm going to go with Germany. And uh, even though Mexico always blows it somehow, I think they finally get past the round of 32 this year. And uh, Sweden, Korea, pulling up the rear. Um, let's see, over here in Group G, I'm going to go with England to finally get past the Group of 32. Go with Belgium, uh, Panama, Tunisia in that order. And lastly, in Group H, I'm going to go with Poland, Colombia, and Senegal with Japan pulling up the rear. So those are our groups. And now we move on to the tournament itself. So let's do that. All right. Round of 16, we got Uruguay taking on Portugal, and uh, for that, I think I'm going to go with uh, Uruguay. Peru taking on Croatia. Mm, I'm going to go with Peru. I think their Cinderella story continues. Brazil and Mexico, foregone conclusion Brazil. England and Colombia. Well, I mean, we know it's England. Eventually they choke. They choke again here. I'm going to go with Colombia and their drug money making it to the quarterfinals. Spain and Russia, uh, yeah, Spain really has no reason to lose that one. Argentina and France, again, I think uh, pretty much for conclusion there, Argentina should win it. Germany and Costa Rica, Germany really has no excuse to lose this one. Poland and Belgium should be pretty good, but at the end of the day, I'm going to go with Poland. So, Germany and Poland, no history there. All right, so Uruguay and Peru, I'm going to go with Uruguay uh, to finally end Peru's Cinderella aspirations. Brazil and Colombia, don't go with Brazil, just a really safe pick. Spain and Argentina, I think I'm going to go with Argentina. And uh, in a huge, colossal upset of epic uh, proportions, I'm going to go with Poland to actually upset Germany. And... Uh, Make it all the way to the quarterfinals. All right, so the final four here. Uruguay and Brazil. I'm going to go with Uruguay. Argentina over Poland. I figure if they already get one upset, why not go for another one? So how about that for my uh, prediction for the World Cup in 2018? Uruguay and Poland. Boy, talk about two uh, economic powerhouses right there. Military leaders, technology leaders, cultural leaders across the globe. Uh, should be entertaining. I think it'll end up being like a 3-2 in overtime. So, uh, I don't know. I think Uruguay's probably the better team. I think Poland's just plucky. They got the heart. I'm feeling Poland this year. You know, I know they have a history of, you know, putting screen doors on submarines and 
going to the sun at night, but uh, I think this year they finally get over the hump, they stop being Pollocks, and they actually win something. So, that's it. I'm going with Poland. Yes, the Poles. Based Poland to go out there and win the 2018 FIFA World Cup in Russia. How about that? Poland winning a championship, a world championship in Russia, and in the process beating Germany. That's called revenge, folks, and it's very, very sweet. Ah, right, those are my picks for the World Cup. Maybe they're right, maybe they're wrong, but uh, I'm back, folks. I'm back, and hopefully Poland wins because I got like 100 bucks on them. So. They better win. That's pretty much all I can say. Mm -hmm.